not the OJ Simpson juice. It didn't fit anyways. I'll take this off. Hello, sirs and madams. Mika ka here, and today we are going to be making a special type of juice. Not the OJ Simpson juice. Oh, it didn't fit anyways. I'll take this off. Not, not the we we wheezing the juice. With a little juice. No, we zing the juice. And not the juice that makes your balls tinier. This is a green juice. It is very healthy. It is good for the prebiotics in the stomach. It is good for uh, inflammation because it has a little bit of turmeric in it. And it also is good for the vitamins in the body. So first we are going to start off with the ingredients of this delicious green juice. First we got some kale. Or no no this is called kale. Kale is in my language that means tomorrow. Then we also got some cilantro. Ugh, I always hated the smell of cilantro. It smells like soap in your mouth. Disgusting. It 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 was yes yes soap poisoning. We got some spinach here. And uh, I want to tell you something. The Popeye movies and the TV show, TV shows of Popeye, they lie to you. This does not make you stronger. You know what makes you stronger? Working out. I am what I am. Then you got some broccoli. This is excellent. It is good for preventing heart attacks and also producing fat attacks. Then you got some celery. You got some parsley. You got some. Cucumbers here, okay, very good cucumbers, you know. And uh, you got a, a lemon, you got turmeric roots, and you got some ginger. So the first thing we're going to do is chop it all up because we are going to be putting it in a juicer, and uh, we need to be able to fit it inside the juicing. So first we're going to chop everything off. We're going to go with the celery, ah, oh, not celery. Like, uh, oh shit, I don't know what happened here. Uh, cilantro. We're going to go with the cilantro first. I like to cut them off in small pieces like this. Put them all back together. We're going to get some of the spinach. You know the theme song. You know, have you ever never watched Popeye? You got to watch Popeye. He is in love with the olive juice. I love you. What? What'd you say? Uh, olive juice. Olive juice? Olive juice, you too. Olive juice, you too. Okay, we're slowly cutting everything up. Broccoli is a little bit complicated. You want to just, you know, stem it. Um, my, my juicer has a lot of big pieces, so you can just keep all the big pieces like this. Very, very good. And you just smooth it in there, very, you know, when you want to do it. Yes, you can use the celery uh, broccoli stock, stock, stocks for it too. No problem. And uh, we're going to take the celery. I, I keep saying everything is celery. Here is the celery. Hey, I got a question for you. How much money you make? Please tell me your salary. Hey, I did good. Uh, it is a little bit dirty, but don't worry about it. Dirt is not going to hurt you. Okay, we got the celery. All right, parsley. Everything is all moist and wet. That's what she said. Huh? What? Who said that? Who said that? Huh? You're talking ventriloquism? Somebody doing the ventriloquism here. Oh, parsley? What? Okay, we got the parsley cut it up. No problem. That should fit in the machine. You take your lemon. Now, my recipe sometimes says half a lemon. I like to put the whole lemon in. Everything in, just not, even the rind, seeds, everything. No problem. We're gonna get the, the, the ginger, cut it in half. Chup, chup, chup. Chup, chup. The turmeric root, you can just keep it as whole. They're like little caterpillars. Like, ooh, hello, little caterpillar. Talk about caterpillar to the butterfly. And then you got the big, the dong dongs. Cut the, get, make it into, um, so you got to make them into smaller dong dongs. So right now these are the, uh, the big ones. I think you meant to say. And then you make them into the Asian ones. Okay, no problem. Oh 
Oh my goodness, all the dong dongs are small now. Welcome to Miami. <laughs> oh wow. And the last but not least, you want to take your kale and chop it up a little bit. Yep, you're going to put everything in there, no problem. Get everything in here like uh, you want to do it properly. You know this thing, the only downside to this thing is that you make a big gigantic mess. There's green stuff everywhere on the floor, in my hand, in my hair probably, in my moustache probably, but you know, it is okay. That is the whole point of this because at the end of the day, you're going to be making something so healthy that your skin will be glowing, like soul glow. Just let your soul glow. I made a mistake in the beginning. One thing I forgot that is a special ingredient. It is apples. Did you know that apples a day keep Dr. Patel's away? And I forgot you need five apples. Oh, you know, sometimes when you're in a rush trying to do all this stuff, you know, maybe I'll put an extra apple for good luck. Extra potash, okay, you know? So anyways, you need five apples. Okay, so the next step you want to do is once you have all your stuff, cut it up. Put it aside, get it ready. I like to have a little bowl because when the juice comes out, I have this machine here, this thing here, and I like to pour it in the bowl and then I pour it into these masanjats because it's good to keep them in messengers and you drink like one in the morning, one in the afternoon or half and half, whatever your preference is. So the next thing we're going to do is we're going to be doing the juicing. You want some juice? Here, you want some juice? The juice right up and you're doing it for a thing. The taste is going to move you. Juicy fruit. The tasty, tasty, tasty is going to move you. I love the juicy fruit commercials. Very good gum. The only downside to the juicy fruit is you chew it, five seconds later on, zero flavor. What is that? 25 cents a packet I used to pay and only get five seconds of flavor. No, 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 bueno. You see that I learned some Spanish. Okay, let's get the juicer. Oh shit, this food is very disgusting. And what you do is you take it, you pour it in here, and then you start on the second batch. And there's a special secret ingredient at the end that I put in that all of you guys have not said it in the video. It's a beauty secret. Really? Phew, this is very, very tough, man. This is a lot of work. My back is starting to harden everything, man. It's like, oh, leaving over like I'm a nerd ducking. I'm like, oh my goodness. Ah! But one thing you gotta make sure you for, don't for, forget is, Make sure you empty out the vessel here because it gets pulled. Look at this, all this leftover gunk. Now, I know a lot of people are gonna be like, oh, don't throw that away. You can make meal out of it or something. Well, you know what? You make the meal out of it. I don't wanna do anything with it. It is a waste of time. And it stinks. Like fart attack. There's a lot of gunk up there too. I'll clean it up later on. You know, the worst thing about juicing, I'll tell you something before I start the next session. The worst thing, is the cleanup. I might have mentioned it earlier, but I'm going to mention it again. Honk the cleanup. I'm hating it. Hate is a strong word. I wish there was a machine that goes troop, troop, and then clean everything up, but not in this world. Okay, we are back. I did the cleaning of the surfaces and everything. It took me almost 45 minutes. It is a big mess. The floor is dirty, everything's dirty, but to make this presentable, I had to clean the whole thing up. So the next thing we're going to do is I got all my juice in the bucket, I got my mason jars, and I got a cup because we need to try it too. But first thing, I told you earlier, the secret ingredient. The secret ingredient of my secret ingredient soup. For my green juice, I like to add organic matcha powder. Very good in the anti anti oxidants, okay? So I don't measure it, I just take it and I just, you know, pour it in as I see fitting here, you know, just a good amount. And uh, that will help boost your... Uh, Owner. <laughs> let's see here. Uh, it is good in natural antioxidants, energy and focus and has a smooth taste. So that is my special ingredient I like to add to my green juice. And then you got to stir it because otherwise it's very powdery. I don't know, we used to have a whisk, but somebody took it. Who knows? Anyways, I'll just use a wooden spoon to stir it. You gotta make sure it gets all in, 
incohesiveness inside the thing. What is that? What is that? There's no clumpiness like pancakes. You don't want to make the pancakes clumpy because then you become very, very, very grumpy. Somebody's grumpy today. <laughs> grumpy wumpy. So let's mix it all in. Make sure it's very good. Another thing while we are mixing it is you have your mason jars. It probably been sitting around for a while. If you let some water in there and you put it away and it smells like like broccoli butt, then your best thing to do is add some hot water and cleanse the surface and kill all the bacteria. So I got me some hot water in my coffee cup and I just poured some water in each one. Ah, no, no, don't do that, you burn your tongue. Okay, anyway, so then you take it and you roll it around a little bit. Ow, shit, it's hot. Ow. Son of a bitch, it is very hot. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness, that is very hot. But uh, I will uh, do all of them real quickly here. Oh my goodness, my fingers are on fire. What an idiot. Did you just fart? Ah, somebody farted over there. Kitty cat. Woo, this is very, 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 very hot. Woo. Okay, after you are disinfected, you are disinfecting the glasses. Now it's time to put this inside of this. So I like to use a little jug like this. Give it a little bit of better stir one more time. Okay, very good, very good. Let's try it out here. Mmm, tastes like green juice. <laughs> okay, and then we just pour it in inside of it. Okay, so I will be posting the ingredients but each one of these mason jars is 16 ounces so that is 2 8 ounces i'm good at math that's in the indian mentality and uh, it makes 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 10 cups which will last you maybe uh, 10 days or if you drink twice a day 5 days but you know it is very good very healthy it is good to have it as a as a, a snack or maybe, you know, if you're doing uh, the, uh, the New Year's Eve resolution and trying to lose the belly fat, then maybe, you know, you can replace it for a meal like a breakfast or lunch or dinner or, or, or winner. Winner, because you're a winner. And that is how you make my super duper green juicer. Okay, ding, ding, ding. Thank you. Come again. I can't even smile in this thing because this moustache is in my way. I forgot to taste it, so let's do it. Let's do a taste test here real quick and see what it tastes like. Mmm, that has zero flavor in it, but it's good and healthy for you. That's all that matters, okay? Don't worry about the taste of the damn green juice. It is worry about all the nutritionists you're getting in your body. It's going to make your skin glow like, like an angel, okay? All right, ding, ding, ding. Thank you. Come again, again.